said in my father's house be many mansions. That's man. right. In my father's house be many mansions, which goes into the different planets, the different solar systems yep. that is for us to explore. Why do you think Esau, out of his heart desire, he been trying hard as hell to go out of space, but the Lord has kept his ass stagnant in that in that in that conquest. He couldn't even get to the moon. He couldn't even get to the moon. He can't pass the the Van Allen belt. And when you look it up, there's actually two two Van Allen belts. Yeah. All right, two two radiation belts that the so-called white man has to pass in order to get outside this Earth's atmosphere. All right, and they say in order to pass that, they would have to build a spaceship completely made of lead. And and that being said, if a spaceship was made completely of lead, it won't even be able to get off the ground because of, of, of the weight of it. So the so-called white man, it wasn't meant for him. That's meant for the Lord's people. That's why when the Lord said, on my right hand, there are pleasures forevermore. Part of that pleasure is seeing the different solar systems, seeing the, the Milky Way up close, all right, seeing um, the, the stars of Orion up close, seeing the sun up close, all right, going through these different galaxies, seeing the different plants and different fruits that the Lord have on these other planets, because the Most High deals with diversity. So every planet ain't going to be the same. Every planet is going to be unique to the creation of the Lord. Continue. Yep. It says, Plenteousness is made ready. Plenteousness is made ready. All right, we're gonna have abundance of everything, man. All right, women. All right, food. All right, uh, wine. All right, everything is gonna be made plenty. We're gonna have so much that you know we ain't gonna know what to do with it. Houses, and houses. You you ain't gonna have like now, Jake. You get an apartment. You happy like that? Moved out my mom's crib, I got me an apartment. Hey, these celebrity niggas get a, get a, a $4 million mansion. That's in, right. And they set with that. Yeah, they think they live in large. We're going to have summer homes, winter homes, fall homes, yeah. different planet homes. All right, because the main headquarters is going to be over there in, in the land of Israel. But we're going to be established throughout the whole universe, man. That's why, hey, that, if I can say something, that's why the Rothschilds hate you niggas so much, man. Because plenteousness is for, is for, is for us. All right, it ain't for them, but they the, the, the shit that they got, which they do have a lot, you no, know, because they they do have a lot in this in this uh, wicked world. They got control over the planet Earth. But like the brother was saying, we gonna go beyond beyond um um the planet Earth, man. All right, and that's for us. That's basically for the for the children of Israel, man. All right, they got they got they they hate us because all of these blessings is is, is for you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. And they got you living in the dirt right now, man. And that's right. And to, and, to, and to believe that one day, because they know that according to the prophecy, that, the prophecies in the Bible, because they know the scriptures, that they know that one day that you so-called Negroes and Latinos and Native American are supposed to have it all, man. All right? Y'all, we supposed to have it all. That's our blessing, man. We're royalty. And they're not. They're pieces of shit. They, they know that they're low lives in the... What seems like they might have plenty of the day, in their near future, they're not going to have shit. It's going to be reduced to nothing, man. Everything that they got is going to be reduced to nothing. That's right. And everything that they got today, which they do have a lot in this society, ain't gonna be, it's going to look like zilch compared to what we're going to have in the kingdom of heaven, man. Yep. Remember, when we read on, it says, plenty of... Plenteousness is made ready. It's made ready through the Spirit of the Lord. The Most High got everything prepared for us, man. All right? Even Yahushua said that he ain't going to drink of the fruit of the vine till he drinking new with us in the kingdom of heaven. There's even wine made prepared for us already, man. All right? So the blessing that we're going to receive is going to be a great blessing, beginning with the elect and all the way down to the two-thirds when they come back as the children of, 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 of the chosen of the Most High. All right? Because like the elders break down, amongst the chosen, there's a chosen. Because mm -hmm. you got the whole nation of Israel is the chosen people, but amongst Israel, there's a chosen remnant, all right, that's going to bring in the kingdom of heaven. Continue. It says, a city is building and rest is allowed. A city is building and rest is allowed. Because the Most High said that this is the time that we're going to enter into his rest. All right. A city is building Jerusalem. All right. Jerusalem is going to be rebuilt. All right. The city of peace, mm -hmm. Jerusalem, all right, which we're the people of peace. We're going to go back to our natural state because the natural state of an Israelite is not to be violent. Although these niggas glorify the violence, all right, oh, I bust a cap in your ass, this, that, and the third, all right, walking the streets with red flags, blue flags, yellow flags, 
talking about all this gang banging, all right? That's not our true nature. We have to be degraded. We have to be degraded and put on a low level to 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 act like that, man. And the so-called white man knows he studied us for so long that he knows how to manipulate manipulate us as a people. Yeah. All right, but our true state is to be in, be righteous. Even these wicked niggas in these industries, they always got a conscience. All right, Tupac, as wicked as this nigga was, he had a an uh, inkling of like he he know he wanted to be righteous, but he was so succumb to the flesh. He's even one on the document said, "I wish I was a an angel of God." Uh, he might be thinking like that. Nah. He, you think Esau, Esau don't believe in God, all right? And if Esau and the because that's a dumb Edomite, because scriptures say that a fool has said in his heart that there is no God. The elites they got a little sense because they know the Most High exists, all right? And they want the blessing of the Lord, but it wasn't created for them. Continue. Yeah, that's because they closer. They closer to Satan, to the spiritual demon Satan, than any of these. That's um, right. These damn average Pierre. So they know. They know the Most High is real, tangible. Yep. All right. He's he's a, the living power, as is written in the scriptures. Yep. It says. Uh, it says, "And rest is allowed." And rest, because we're gonna enter into the, to the rest of the Lord. All right. Yep. This is not our rest. This, like the, like the brother said, which is he quoted. Um, Michael 2 and 10 yep. that this ain't our rest man. We wasn't brought here to live peaceably All right, because when you read the scriptures the way that the Lord described the kingdom is gonna be the floors is gonna be paved with gold Wouldn't you rather want that than walking on this concrete that fucks your joints up your back? You got back pain you 16 years old with back pain all right joint arthritis would you rather have a place with, with, with sapphires and rubies? It's the vibration of the kingdom of heaven is going to be so strong, it's going to be majestic. It's going to be almost like it's, it's magical, man. Yep. And it says, um, it says, yea, perfect goodness and wisdom. Yea, perfect goodness because the law, statute, commandments is going to be put in our inward hearts in perfect wisdom, which is the word of the Lord. We're going to be perfect in the word of the Lord. Continue. The root of evil is sealed up from you. The root of evil is sealed up from you. Because these bodies, these vile, corruptible bodies are going to be taken away from us. And we're going to put on the, the, the fleshly heart instead of the stony heart. So that all the wicked thoughts that come, come into our minds on a daily basis that we got to struggle with, all right, it's going to be done away with. We're going to be in complete righteousness, man. Our vibration is going to be a pure vibration. And we're going to have a glow because of that. All right? Because the scriptures say, wisdom make it a man's face to shine. So in the kingdom, we're going to have that perfect wisdom. That we're going to, we're going to glow. We're going to be vibrant. It says, weakness in the moth is hid from you. Weakness in the moth. The moth represents corruption. All right? Because when the moth... Gets into your closet, what does it do? It eats away at your clothes, it destroys. Alright? So weakness, alright, that this weak, feeble bodies, man, getting sick, getting a common cold, being tired. Being tired, alright, being fatigued, alright, that's gonna be done away from us, man. And corruption is gonna be done away from us. Continue. And corruption is fled into hell to be forgotten. And corruption is fled into hell, the grave, to be forgotten. All right, because we ain't gonna be no corrupt Israelites in the kingdom of heaven, even to the point that ain't gonna be an Israelite that dies of a heart attack and that his body has to go like the Esau does it, buried six feet under, and that the worms and all uh, and, 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 the, and the maggots eat 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 at his flesh. All right, that's not gonna happen. Same way Yahweh Shai, the Lord said that He wanted to suffer His body to see corruption. That's the same thing that's gonna apply to us in the kingdom of heaven. And these and these demons and these demons and Satan and the so-called white, but they they're not gonna and these other nations they're not gonna be able to have no effect on your so-called Negroes to manipulate you to go off, man. That's right. Yep. But um, it says verse fifty-four. This this is the last verse. It says, "Uh, sorrows are past. Sorrows are past. There ain't gonna be no Jake walking with his head down, his shoulder down, you know, because he's so depressed. You gonna see no Jake getting drunk and crying because of all the pain that he feels." All right, you, all that sorrow is gonna be done away with, man. You gonna see no Jake sorrowing over that the, the government took his kids away and put them in, 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 in foster cares. Ain't gonna be seeing no Jake sorrowing because his woman took his kids and the, and the government granted her ch ch child child um what's the child shit support not child support granted her um custody of oh, the children. Child custody, yeah. yeah, ain't gonna be none of that in the kingdom of heaven, man. The kingdom of heaven is first and foremost is for you men out there, man. Cause right now the, these women are in their rulership. 
when the kingdom of heaven is going to be established in righteousness first and foremost for the men of Israel. All right, because we're we're the most high's pleasant plant. We're the flock of his pasture. All right, we're the apple of his eye. He made us in his likeness. All right, he gave us his, the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding to make us to separate us from all these other nations. Continue. It says, and in the end, it showed the treasure of immortality. And in the end, shows the treasures of immortality, which immortality comes through this world. That's why in, in the book of Genesis, all right, the the, the, the Lord said. Let's take away from, from Adam the, the tree of life. At least he live forever. At least he eat there of the fruits and live forever. Now we gain in the knowledge of the tree of life. And that's what's going to bring our immortality, man. Which is all the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the Most High. Yeah. All right? For us to live a thousand years in one body. All right? That's what the kingdom of heaven is going to entail. All right? Us being perfect, never getting sick. We can have a typical death like these other nations are, are going to continue to have for for the rest of eternity, all right, for age after age. In the kingdom, when we leave, we're going to leave just like um, Enoch left, all right, just like um, um, Elijah left. They they didn't suffer death. Yeah. How much more when we in the perfection in the kingdom of heaven? It's going to be like taking a vacation. Man. Exactly. You're just going to go to the spirit world when you when, when you, you feel, choose. When yeah, you choose. When you feel. When you say like, like I'm tired. I um I want to go back to the spirit world. And and the knowledge and the wisdom of most most high is ever grown. All right. There's no end to learn. So the kingdom of heaven is always going to be something to do because the universe is so vast and ever growing. The Lord says new creatures newly created every day. So this, this, the basic life we live ain't shit compared to what we're gonna receive in the kingdom. All right, so that, that was it on that. Yeah, that was that was um, that was it on that. So with that, you know, through the spirit of the Lord, we came into this show. You know, we like to say the water, Yahweh Bashim Yahshai, Barakatah Yahweh Bashim Yahshai. You know, double honor to our elders. You know, y'all brothers know know who the elders are, and we'll say shalom to all you brothers out there in doing the fight of faith. You know, we're gonna say. You no know, death to America. Death to America. All right, and let this new year bring more death and destruction to all people who oppose the will of the Lord. Let the so-called white man and his race be, be be troubled, as we've been troubled since we came to the side of the earth. That's right. All right, and let all wickedness come to an end, and let the righteous kingdom be established. Yep. So with that, we're gonna say shalom. Shalom, Akim. Yep.